Okie dokie, we are almost ready to go up the mountain. I had some breakfast. I just had um, a courgette cut up in like an arm with like eggs scrambled into it with some turkey, ham, bacon stuff. Um, I'm just wearing sports gear, my gym shark leggings. And I was wearing my Lulu top, but then I thought it would get cold, so I put a thermal one over top. So now I'm wearing like <laughs> all grey. I feel silly, but it's okay. So yeah, enjoy this beautiful mountain footage. <laughs> We get lost, we can get high Because me gone, I feel alive Anywhere, anyway, I will love you We rule the world, just you and I Just let me down, we walk the line But now nothing's gone wrong, I'll take a shot for you Give me Tuna never is never a bad idea. Oh, heaven. So I have a whole large capsicum, a whole cucumber, two boiled eggs, a whole avocado, and a whole can of big tuna. Yes! Okay, I highly recommend this salad. It's so good, I didn't even put any dressing on it. I think the capsicum really makes it flavorful and delish. Look how beautiful it is. Over there is France, and over there is Spain, which is pretty cool.
Okay, so that sound is actually fucking huge. I'm really wrong. But I guess it's like a whole cucumber and a whole capskin. Quite a lot. But very low calories, so that's what we want. I think I might food coma now. And then we'll walk down the hill. But you know what? I've eaten so much, I'll probably just roll. <laughs> I just got home and had a shower and got ready to go out for dinner soon but oh my gosh today was so amazing we just literally spent the whole day being active and eating food and those are my two favorite things ever so we walked up La Rune which was two hours up and two hours down so like it was definitely like I was sweating it was definitely a workout and it was such nice weather and just such a good way to spend a day like four hours of walking sounds like a lot like obviously you wouldn't be walking inclined on a treadmill for two hours straight like it was fun it was good and also on the treadmill it's like maximum incline is like 15 this was at some stages like I don't even know what the percentage would be but it was steep very steep but it was really fun and I made that killer salad and it was actually really like big so it kept me full for ages and yeah my camera ran out of space on the way down so I didn't record anything else but feeling very happy with the day tomorrow is our last day so I think I'm just gonna go swimming with my host dad in the morning um, and then go to another town of the city beyond have a little look around but I'm just gonna go to dinner now and go to sleep because I am so tired and my feet are so sore. I also received an email from my auntie in Barcelona and she said I can come stay with her whenever I want and when they go to their holiday home in the mountains that I can come join and I'm so excited for that. Dad said that we'll get on to organizing that trip. Yay! Barcelona! And I'm wearing an my new pants for the first time. I did not. Ugh, I just got back from swimming. I woke up this morning extremely, extremely sore. Like my calves and my like after glute are so sore from yesterday's walk. But I had a quick 60 laps or something in the pool and now I feel great. We're going to the supermarket to get some stuff for lunch. I probably have the maddest goggle marks right now. And yeah. It is 11.30 and I didn't eat anything before I went swimming, so I am starving. <sighs> swimming makes me so angry. Just went to the supermarket to buy some food and I am honestly a zombie. It's 5.14 and I haven't eaten anything and that's swimming just really. kind of makes me laugh because I've been reading so many people's like Instagram posts and in YouTube videos and stuff and they talk about like balance in terms of how like fitness is good and you should like if you love it it's great but it shouldn't be like it should be part of like a part of your lifestyle not like the whole thing you should, shouldn't have an obsession about it because you should spend time like going out with your friends or doing work or whatever <laughs> like literally don't have any friends to go out with don't have any school work don't have a job so I don't need to balance anything because fitness is the only thing in my life currently <laughs> and that sounds really really sad well, I guess I can hang out with my host parents and the last week of holidays has been fantastic.
but also has involved a lot of activity for me. I don't have the choice whether or not for it to be my whole lifestyle or just part of it because I have nothing else to add to my lifestyle. Maybe I'll make friends one day. return from looking around Bayon Town. I did not buy anything but it was really really pretty. Today is our last day when we're leaving in the morning so I'm very sad. <sighs> it's been a phenomenal week. Like the best week I've had since being here in such a good mind. Free. Don't want to go back to school. Don't want to go I don't mind the suck, but just don't want to go back to school. Want to stay in Bayonne forever. But we'll see how it goes. I have thoroughly enjoyed vlogging my trip. So, if you're watching, I hope you're not bored by now. Goodbye. So just as we parked up at home, the delivery woman came with the package from Gymshark that included the impulse jogger top and bottom track suit. Oh my god, I'm so in love. I got the top and a medium because the small sold out and the pants and the small and I am in love. They're like high waisted and so super comfy. They have a little panel at the back. And then the top, I'm actually kind of happy I got the medium because like there's a little bit of room, I can wear another layer underneath and they have the thumb holes, which I love. A little logo there. They have a little zip that goes all the way up. That's your style. It's not really my style, but you know. Ugh, now my hair's all caught in it. Like that. And the little logo. They're so soft and so comfortable and I'm so happy that they arrived right on time. But anyway, that is the end of all my footage from all my vlog thing. So if you like it, give me a thumbs up, be sure to subscribe. There definitely won't be a new video every three days, but we'll see what happens.